Good evening, friends. I hope you're all doing well. I'm also fine. So my name is Atikul Ram, an AWS Certified Solutions Architect and also DevOps Engineer. I'm going to show you today how you can uh, clone your Git repositories from AWS Code Commit using um, the HTTPS method. So let's get started. The first thing is I'm going to create a repository. That's pretty simple. If you go to create repositories, then Give it a name. So this thing, this is the repo. And it will create the repo. Then uh, if you go to the list view, there are three options to clone this Git repo. One that is HTTPS, SSH, HTTPS GRC. I'm going to show you today HTTPS method. So let's copy this part. <laughs> and let's go to our terminal. Go to a directory, git test, cd git test. Okay, here I'm going to do git clone. So pretty simple. And then paste the endpoint. So remember, this is HTTPS, not SSH. So here I will be asked a an username and password. So let's go to create a new username. I'm in my IAM dashboard and let's going to create a user. So I'm just going to give it a name, git user. Next, I'm going to give him a code commit full access. Sorry, typing mistake, code, code. So uh, you can give full access or power user. I think power user should be sufficient. The less privilege is better. Create user, then click on view user part. So here are the user details. In the view user section, go to the fourth tab called security credentials. Inside the security credentials, you will have an option to create a Git uh, HTTPS credentials. So generate one. Now you have generated one uh, Git HTTPS credentials. So just copy the username here. And then let's move back to our terminal and paste the username. Then I'm going to uh, copy the password. This is the password copied. And let's paste it here. Okay, you have cloned an empty repo. So let's check it. Go to uh, the testing. Okay, now uh, I wanted to save these grid credentials permanently so that I don't have to write it down or give this username password every time I make it pull. So how do I do that? Simple. Uh, I have to just run this command. Git config credentials helper store. So uh, I'm going to give this instruction as a video description so you can just copy paste from that. Now, if I do git pull, okay, let's add a new file, touch sample.txt, git add, git add dot git commit minus m initial commit. Git push. So this is being done. And now git pull. All this is done. Now let's do something different. Let's create a new one. As I have saved my repositories, this shouldn't ask me any more again. So uh, this is second repo. Create a second repo. Go to the list view and copy the HTTPS. Let's go to our terminal again and do git clone. Yeah, so uh, that's already saved and I don't have to provide my username and password one more time again. So this is pretty uh, useful way to save credentials locally. 
and you don't have to provide each time the username and password and uh, all those things. So that's being said, this is the easiest way to clone repositories from AWS code commit into your local machine. So this will work on your Windows, Mac, Linux, all those platforms. I have shown in Linux, but you can try with Windows machines as well and Mac as well. So this will all work. Remember that you have to install Git first. I already had Git installed, so I don't have to reinstall it again. But for your purpose, you have to install the Git first and then run those commands. So thank you for watching my video. Please subscribe to my channel to get more news like this. Thank you. Have a nice day. Bye-bye.